Hey everybody, it's Jason with the Board Game Mechanics, and today we're going to take a look at a little card game called Sunny Day Sardines. Sunny Day Sardines is a game designed by Jeremiah Acevedo. I probably said that incorrectly. I do apologize. Plays two to four players in 15 minutes and published by 25th Century Games. Now, in this game, what you're doing is you are catching salmon, selling them for orders. That's it. It's a little tiny card game where you're going to either take some salmon or you're going to turn salmon in. Just make orders and score points. That's it. Let's go down to the table. Check it out. All right, so here's a game of Sunny Day Sardines, all set up for three players. To set up, you're going to shuffle the sardine cards, flip five, give each player two. You're going to shuffle the order cards, flip four, and you are set up and ready to go. What you're trying to do in this, turn, um, in this game is you are trying to collect as many sardines as you can to turn them in for orders, all right? And there's different kinds of orders. There's uh, regular orders where I need to get two green fish. There's some special kinds of order here where I need to do certain numbers of certain colors of fish. And then there's going to be some where I have to get one of each of the different colors fish in the number on the card. So the way the game works is this player will go first. On your turn, you're going to do one of two things. You're either going to take two salmon, so either one card with two salmon or two different cards with one salmon, add it to your hand, or you're going to complete an order. And this player is going to go ahead and complete an order. So they'll take this, they'll take this one, and they'll have two points, they'll put that face down, and that's their turn. The game is going to end when this deck runs out. All right, now this player, what do they have? They have two greens, they're really bummed about that, but they're going to go ahead and take these two oranges, and they'll put these in their hand. All right, this player will refill. This player has two blues, an orange, and a green. Mm, let's go with two reds. They're going to take the two reds. All right, done. Back to me. I have one orange card. So I'm going to take, I want this. So now I have two orange cards. Flip. This player has a lot of cards, two orange, two greens. And I think they're gonna go ahead and spin those cards, two orange, two greens, to complete this six point order. And now they are in the game with an order. New order. This player has two reds, an orange and a green, and two blues. Hmm. They don't wanna do anything with that yet. So they're gonna take these two reds. Again, two cards with one fish or one card with two fish. That's what you can do. Back to me. I have two oranges. Let's grab a blue and an orange here. Done. Other player doesn't have any cards, so they're going to snag this double orange card. This player, they have four green, four red, orange, green, and two blues. I'll try to splay it as best I can. And they're going to spin their four reds to complete this. And now they're in the game with a can of sardines. All right, let me show you one of the other cards. Here's one of the other cards. Let's say that's what came out. That is a, what's it called, a mixed bag. I need to spend two fish of different colors to complete that. It's the number of fish and then one, a different color for each of the fish that's on there. And that's how the game's gonna keep playing. You're gonna just take one of those two actions, complete an order, take some cards, and once this deck runs out, whoever has the most points is the winner. That's how you play Sunny Day, Sunny Day Sardines. Let's go to the top, see what you think about it. All right, well, that was Sunny day sardines. So let's talk about the components. Not a lot going on here. A cool tin, kind of like a sardine can, so it makes sense. Don't love tins, but you can put this on it and pretend like it's not a tin. 
and inside just cards just cards with some salmon of different colors they are different types like they look different as well like here's blue and green you can tell that they're different fish they look different uh, so there's a bunch of those and then there's a pile of gold cards that you're trying to complete and those are the components cards are pretty nice quality they're easy to shuffle not linen finish or anything but for what's going on in this game that's overkill um, so yeah components are fine now let's talk about the game what you saw in the overview is what this game is it is a pretty basic set collection contract fulfillment game you're collecting fish taking a fish from the, or two from the aisle or the row and then eventually turning them into score points that's it uh, there's not a lot of other things going on there's not a lot of deep strategy it's just hey i need to collect these fish to turn them in to score those points that's it so i'm not going to belabor this review because there's no need to you saw what this game is if you're interested in that then check this game out if that doesn't look like something you would enjoy then this one might be one to pass on uh, i like it it's not one that i'm going to bust out a lot uh, i'll play it if someone wants to i like the can i like the look of it i like the cards um, but it's probably something I'll just put in my pocket and play at like a restaurant or something occasionally just to pass some time. So that is Sunny Day Sardines from 25th Century Games. I'm Jason with the Board Game Mechanics. And as always, keep gaming.